In a quaint living room, a woman cheerfully shares with her friend how wonderful her husband is, lauding his devotion and kindness. Meanwhile, at a bar, the husband watches a woman walk by and decides to follow her, intent on a clandestine rendezvous. The woman the husband follows meets with an investor who demands sexual favors before signing any contract. When she threatens to expose his misconduct, he slaps her. At that moment, the husband arrives and, witnessing the assault, enlists some locals to handle the investor aggressively. Upset by the violence, the woman slaps the husband, revealing that he is the only man she has been with. Caught in the moment, they kiss, and he follows her to a hotel room. At the hotel, the situation escalates when the woman drugs the husband's drink. As he collapses into unconsciousness, she retreats to the bathroom. Meanwhile, worried by her husband's absence and his failure to respond to her calls, the wife decides to look for him. As she approaches the hotel, she receives a call about her father's severe car accident and rushes to the hospital instead. The husband awakens from a deep sleep, troubled by dreams of his wife's past abuse. He checks his phone to find frantic messages about her father's accident and immediately heads to the hospital. At the hospital, as he learns from his wife that her father may never recover, the other woman enters unexpectedly. To his shock, and unknown to him until now, the other woman is his wife's father's secretary. The tension peaks as the wife, noticing her husband's stunned reaction to the secretary's arrival, questions his fidelity and attraction. Overwhelmed by the unfolding drama, he struggles to respond, his guilt and deceit laid bare under the harsh lights 